Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode two of Hero Gato Sky Pretty Here. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. The fuck they were starting right here. Ah, uh, good. Yes. I also do like the fact that, yeah, it's starting here is good. Like, we're starting right where last week's episode ended. Hey, baby. It's fine. Hmm? <laughs> Can we also talk about how pretty the music is already? I mean... But I am secretly kind of hoping that they use old music from older series. Ah, hi! <laughs> oh. Well, babe, that's, you know, probably the fire trucks and the police. Oh, my God. He's so cute. Oh, my He's a precious baby. Uh, should we talk? Nope, 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 nope. We're not going to talk about that now, of course. As I said, there is something. If you follow me on Twitter, there's something I want to talk about that pertains with the show. But... We're gonna wait until the end of the episode just to make it a little bit longer. Um, but yeah, that's all I can say. I mean, it, it's gonna be a little obvious what I'm talking about and such, but once again, well, you'll wait till the end. <laughs> The fact that we gotta wait probably how long for Butterfly and Wing? Oh my god. Like, I mean, we're not getting Prism until, like, what, episode 4 S. So, if it was my opinion, we might not get Wing and Butterfly, like, mid-10 to episode 20. Well, maybe. Because, of course, we're doing something, like, completely different. Or, no, because Tropical Rouge did it, Delicious did it, so we're doing it with this as well. That's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a pretty house. This is your house? G oh, whoa, God. Are you just rich? Yeah, I mean, you know, definitely. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Even the baby is making a face. I can't. You know, I'm, I'm going to say this right now. What if a grandma is cured butterfly? I mean, because we, cause we don't know what her human form is. That's the thing. But I could be wrong. Yeah. Well, babe, it's going to take you at least 40-something episodes. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh. She could be possibly hungry. fact that her grandma has stuff on handy. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Once again, we're just saying, hey, ain't this little kid in the anime cute? Don't you want a kid of your own? Oh, baby, he's falling asleep. Oh. <laughs> you just stay here. Mm -hmm. And you can decorate it. Day. I thought it was okay, so it's fine. Stop. 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 You did that in the first chapter of the manga, ma'am. Uh oh. <laughs> well, when you are busy as heck, yeah, you fall asleep very quickly.
Oh, definitely. <laughs> Oh my god, Sora! <laughs> Yeah, because, you, you know, you got a little science track. Sora, she'll be fine. That's all she can say right now, but she's so fucking cute. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, oh my god. Yeah, it makes sense to call her Owl. Oh, don't worry. You'll see him again today. Yeah, you will see him, unfortunately. I mean, yeah, remember, you have a pretty care with you. <laughs> it's okay, it's just a phone. Ah, we'll see about that, babe. <laughs> Oh, well, yeah, it's a mall. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, is it something else where they want to just a tracksuit? Not that though. I mean, that's cute. <gasps> Love it. Are we going to finally talk about the one lady from the opening? Of course we are!
Yeah, the notebook. Yeah. <laughs> Say somewhere. See, ain't it even also weird how she's look mm, 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 grandma. It's always the grandma's. I don't know, because I'm a, when we get to the ending, we already know about Wing. I got to look up Butterfly one more time. Okay, never mind, never mind. The butterfly? Mm -mm, I don't think that's her. But she does, she's connected to L. The question is, how? It's only episode two and there's so many freaking questions. The fact that they are now with, because it's episode two, they're zooming in on it more. I'm not mad at it. It's good because, you know, it's a good ass transformation scene. I'm just saying, but like, ooh. Ugh. Of course, we have we we have to have yes uh, holding the girlfriend. <laughs> this is now also making me regret. I wish I bought a rubbing plush, but maybe later. I mean, because you know, gotta do it.
guys, stop it. <laughs> Once again, loving the fact that we can instantly see her de transform like that. Oh, but where are you going? Where are we going? Because you gotta show the freaking merch. Oh, like for her notebook? Seriously, take it. It's a gift. That because he wants to make you happy. Oh my god. <laughs> but yeah, okay. All right, all right, all right. All right. Big, 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 big thing. All right. See, that's the interesting question. Are they going to put that in the Crunchyroll endings? I mean, because see, now that changes things. That changes everything. Crunchyroll, you better do it. I better, next week, I better see some freaking cure white, cure black, cure everybody. Every single week. The fact that they get to vote in Japan. I don't want to see the just the four of them. I need to see five. I'm ready to see freaking go princess, freaking Maho girls, everybody, everybody showing up on us. I need to see it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have faves. I need to. I want to see my faves first, regardless. But it's okay if my faves don't show first. So it's okay. All right, all right, all right. okay. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay. So grandma. Robinine's grandma. Like, yes, of course. I'm not surprised that she has a connection to Princess L, but I was expecting them to, like, oh, we're going to show it and find out later on in the series. But I do like the fact because they're being different. They're like, here, we're putting it in the second episode. They know. We know as the audience, but the girls won't know until later on in the, you know, in the series, of course. Um, well, our, our three girls and one boy. So, let me take that back. Uh, but I wonder how, like, he, Mahiro, Babarin, how she's going to take it. And when she learns that her grandma is not just, you know, an ordinary grandma. And especially with that mirror. Once again, <laughs> you know, slash that mean. Oh, for the win of Mean Queen 2023. <laughs> but I mean, yeah, okay. But no, we saw the bird. We saw baby bird. Oh my god, I was not expecting to see him today. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. My heart is ready. So when he makes an appearance, because that like right now, regardless. He is the most anticipated episode for everybody. Besides Mashiro slash Robinine becoming finally a party cure, like that is that is the next step. But the most anticipated episode is the freaking bird becoming a party cure and seeing how they do the transformation for him. This is now he's the first official boy. Um despite counting um what's his face from like Hagato and then um or even Picario from Kitty Kitta. Or, yeah, you can kind of really count also um, Black Pepper. Black Pepper? Yeah. From Delicious, but mm -mm. Baby Boy is the first boy. That's it. End of the day. But, I mean, yeah, the episode was solid. I, I love the fact that we got more focus on the girls, especially, like, a little bit more on Sora and especially why she wants to be a hero and how she was inspired of course us 
her seeing her, what I like to call her all might version of a hero in this series. And then it's just like, yes, I want to be a hero. Kind of also gave me Utena, Utena Principal. No, no, no. Revolutionary girl Utena. There we go. Mm hmm mm hmm Wrong show. Mm hmm Definitely not talking about the idol show. Talking about that other show. Yes. But, I mean... But, yeah. All right, all right, all right. So, let, no, no, no. Let's go on to the Cure Butterfly thing. So, since I don't now think Cure Butterfly is um, Mashiro's grandmother, from what a lot of people were saying between last week's episode going on into this, uh, this week's episode... The butterfly, the lipstick. Every single season ever since Tropical Rouge with the cosmetics line coming in, there's always something different. Of course, Tropical Rouge had seashells and everything because, of course, tropical seashells, beachy, everything. Um, Delicious Party's makeup line, I don't, I barely really remember what that looked like because they didn't always have an episode where they were going to Pretty Holic. But now in this, you see butterflies and such so it makes me kind of think that your butterflies character of course we know she's 18 she's she's an adult but i feel like still she possibly is just now coming out of high school and she works at the pretty holic or she owns it like with a family member or something and once we officially get to that then they'll be like okay this is what we're doing with her and such but the little sneak peeks of the cosmetic from last week and this week indicating that she is close, but, you know, not far away because who knows when she's officially going to make her appearance because, of course, she is the last one up until now and until, you know, the last one comes in. But, of course, yeah. So, now let's go on to the big old elephant in the room. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Okay, so two, three days ago on YouTube of all places, um... Okay, no. So this is good. First, it started on Twitter. So, of course, when every new Pretty Cure series comes out, the toys will always usually come out the same week. Um, the animated beats. Um, and I remember this going into when I started reacting to Pretty Cure and stuff. When I was going all the way back to Kitty Kitty Pretty Cure mode and wanted the freaking sweets pack because I was like, oh my God, this is gorgeous as fuck and stuff. Well, there have been times where people have like tweaked with the toys and such. And then we eventually find out or hear the voice of the final cure. I can only really say that for Kitty Kitty, it happened. I don't really remember from Hugato up too delicious if it really you know ever happened normally around this time usually about week two week two, week two three four maybe about week 10 of the show we start getting like the name of the final cure and stuff and, but when going in from like hugato to delicious like i heard nothing i think maybe because i kind of like stayed away from the spoilers but the Act. Okay, so going back to my thing. So the toy, um, somebody was review, uh, reviewing it on YouTube and such. And I looked at it, saw like the lights and everything for both Sky, Prism, Wing, and Butterfly. And some, uh, the same person, two, three days later, posted something with the final cure. So we know the name is Cure Majesty. And her color is sort of purple-esque I'm not 100% sure and such but I have to go back and look but it just seemed very purple base and it would make sense because we have a we know okay we have a blue we have a white we have a orange yellow and then we have a pink and then to 50 out of 50 the last cure is usually maybe a red a purple um for La Mer that was like a blue um or turquoise as but more blue still um freaking uni was kind of a rainbow esque in a way but still blue so when i watched it and listened to it very closely it once again does sound like um of course l's say you aka kaguya-sama or um <laughs> Food from Genshin Impact. 
and stuff. So it, it sounds more and more like her. So once again, we are making that bet. Even though technically a couple of weeks ago, we already made the prediction and the bet and everything that she will be the final cure. But a lot of people also feel like we might get two final cures. I'm not 100% sure on that. Now, if something else does come in the works, because we're only two weeks into this show and everybody is tweaking the heck out of that toy to find everything very quickly. Um, it's funny enough at the same time, too. I think about a day or two ago, I also saw typically what we get really more about like episode 15 going on to 20 when the final care finally makes an appearance the fake leaks of what she looks like and then of like the fake drawn and everything and then what she actually looks like when she finally makes an appearance so we know she's gonna look purple-esque I, I think I'm guessing because of her hair and such but who really knows but the fact that we already know her the name and such is good but it, it's her. It, it, it's Kaguya-sama. Once again, Kaguya-sama is going to be a pretty care. Freaking uh, Komi-san, Komi, you're becoming a pretty care. And I'm fucking happy about that. Like, seriously. Once again, like, all my fave saviors in, like, the last few years are all becoming pretty cares. Like, I love it. It's so good. I have so many others. Like, you don't even know. Please, like... Uh, but yes, the episode was good. I'm super excited to see who the next, the first two, or one here, next one, in the ending for next week, is dancing with them. Because of course, no matter what, I'm always going to fangirl over whoever it is. Whether it's Black White, I don't remember the two um, from the other series, Shiny Luminous. Hell, I would like Cure Echo to even make an appearance. Like, yes. Please. Like, she's super underrated and she doesn't get to appear in a lot of stuff. The last time we saw Cure Echo was the last All Stars movie, and that was with Maho Girls. And they, they was like, yeah, we're going to go ahead and add her in. You can do it now. You could just literally add her in. But I mean, of course, when we get into my ultimate faves, like, I'm probably going to freaking fangirl and cry. <laughs> Regardless, they're all my favorites and such. It's just going to be so good. Like, to just have a little memory and such. But I'm super excited for next week. Because we're also getting close to Cure Prism transforming and such. And that's going to be good. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction for you towards episode 2 of Hanagato Sky Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 3. Bye, guys.